Hello Lulas, welcome back to my channel guys. So I'm back here with uh, Prototype Billy. And um, as you guys know, she is from Silicone Studio. Blank kits are available for order. Um, I know she is, Kathy is uploading so many at a time so that she don't have a backlog of getting them poured and shipped out. And then she's, um, you know, going to make sure she get all her orders out and stuff and then she'll, you know, do another batch later. So if you want to get in the first round, then you should go ahead and order now. Um, the website is www.siliconestudio2.com and I just wanted to pop in and show her outfit of the day. <laughs> Oh my gosh, and I've been trying to figure out what type of pacifier I like on her, and I really like this pacifier on her. Unfortunately, it's one that I had clipped the nipple on for, you know, to modify for a baby that couldn't take a full pacifier. So, um, I'm going to try to see if I can go online and find another one like this. If not, I'm going to have to look for one, another one that I like on her to send home with her. Um, but, yeah. So, I really, really, I like that one on, on her the most. and Because I, I like her without a pacifier. Most, you know, pretty much. But she does look really cute with a pacifier. So, um, if I can zoom in so you guys can see what pacifier it is. I I gotta I don't even have to check the brand even but yeah so yeah so she is like I said I'm I'm loving that she can I can go in my closet pull out an outfit and she can fit it and I don't have to you know like struggle with it I mean I love my preemie babies I love my in between babies but the shopping for them can be a little challenging versus, you know, a more full size baby. So, um, it's been kind of exciting to, to have her. Although a lot of stores are, um, cutting back on the smaller sizes, but when I went into Marshall's recently, they actually had newborn. And so I think they're starting to get, starting to get, newborn size back in usually it's zero to three and the only time she can wear zero to three is if the brand is cut small but she can wear um h and m zero to one month she can wear of course carter's newborn she can wear um some clothes that i um got and i don't remember the brand but it's up to one month and um, some of those like outfits like from Zara and places like that, they, they have like up to one month or um, first size and stuff like that. They don't have like our same, you know, sizing. But anyway, I always, when I get a new baby, I don't know about you guys, do you guys like pre-shop before the baby make it to you? Or do you wait till the baby get there and shop? I used to pre-shop until I kept realizing that every time I do that, either I don't like the outfits on the baby or it didn't fit. So I just started getting to the point where I would just wait. Like I would get some like onesies or maybe socks, pacifiers, you know, uh, bibs hats if it was going to be a ball baby um just the little essentials that not really that big of a deal but when the baby got there that's when I really shop so I always advise people to kind of wait till your baby get to you so you can kind of get an idea of what they will wear um so and then sometimes you know you get a baby and you uh you may not want to keep it <laughs> and then you bought all these these clothes so 
because you know we're constantly you know we're constantly buying <laughs> so oh i just bought that but i wanted this one okay i'm gonna sell this one and get that one it's just you know anyway um it's it's a lot of that goes on but yeah so really nice and also another thing is i a lot of babies now are having like one fist and one open hand which is fine um because it gives you you know that the best of both worlds um but it's nice also that she has you know like all separate um fingers and stuff like that so anyway i just like i said i just wanted to pop in her little stomach so cute um i just wanted to pop in and share her little outfit of the day i'm not gonna keep make this a long video i have a couple videos coming out also guys oh well i guess i should just i'll i'll tell you guys about that later um but yeah i started getting her little stuff in so i've put her up um for sale i was i was struggling with it like i'm like uh should i put her up for sale should i not like it's just i don't know what's wrong with me every time i paint a baby i want to keep it <laughs> if it's not a custom i want to keep it like i can't you know even some of the customs i wanted to keep but i couldn't keep so i'm like i have one coming i i specifically said i would have another one coming but i kind of I, I I I knew I would probably <laughs> soon as I got the blank here and I saw the um sculpt in person I was like oh my gosh I'm probably not gonna want to let this baby go so it's uh definitely you know one of those things but I'm doing it I'm doing it <laughs> I'm trying I'm trying but anyway that is it oh her feet I would still probably go with a zero. Mm, I would still probably go with a zero. She, yeah, if you can get the zeros, I would get a zero. She might be able to do a one in Baby Deer. I'm not sure. I have to. I should have tried that on, but no, oh, that's the only brand I buy for the most part. Other than like Carter's zero to three. And stuff and I know I had these little shoes here the zero to three and they're a little big but if I really wanted to put them on her I would have well they're big but if I wanted to put them on her I would have still put them on her for pictures but like that's about it but anyway we will talk later oh sometime Carters do have newborn too They'll have newborn and they're smaller. So um, you can get shoes from there too. All right, I gotta go. I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.